Hey guys, Gary here. Thanks for watching. Uh, so, you guys know I'm kind of looking at, uh, I've been doing this minimalist thing to a degree. And uh, one of the things that I uh, did a video on, I'll put the link right here, I hope, and uh, it was a minimalist gun belt. So instead of a war belt, I just turned it into a gun belt. That's literally all it is. It holds two magazines and a pistol. There's a knife on the, on the holster, but that's it. So uh, anytime that I'm going to be carrying a rifle, that's the belt that I put on to carry a pistol with. Instead of carry, trying to carry concealed, and that gets in the way of my chest rig and all that kind of stuff. So that sets the holster just a smidgen further out and a smidgen further down so that it's away from all the straps going around my waist. And uh, But one problem I found was I always have worn this belt. You know, I put on a pair of VDU pants or... ACUs or cry pants, thanks to him. Uh, I would wear, you know, a, a, I always wear an everyday carry belt from Willis over at SOE. And this multi cam one is the one that I would wear with my multi cam pants because, you know, color coordination and stuff like that. Anyway, problem I found with it was uh, I've got this Cobra buckle right here, but generally run right around the front. Then I put the gun belt on, and I put that other Cobra buckle right on top of it, which kind of made a whole lot of fucking belt buckle right in front of me. So then I would try to offset this one, and offset the other one, so that it wasn't like this giant mass of aluminum awesome buckle. I mean, Cobra buckles are fucking fantastic. I know the functional gentleman, not a fan, but uh, he's wrong. It happens once in a while. I know, he's got some college degrees and whatnot. Hey man, I taught at a college. He could have been my student. Anyway, uh, so with all the Cobra Buckle awesomeness, I did find that trying to stack them on top of each other was a bit problematic. Now, years ago, I used to play paintball many, many moons ago. See, cool picture right there, me playing paintball. And uh, in those days, we had, you know, the, the packs with all the paint and stuff on them and a small belt belt buckle underneath of those was ideal just for comfort reasons. So I used to wear something like this guy right here, which was just two D-rings and a cheap fucking cotton woven belt. I thought, well, man, something like that, that'd probably work all right underneath my gun belt. Just all it's got to do is hold up my pants. I'm not carrying a gun on it or anything else. It's just holding up my pants. However, I was not going to wear this chick's belt. So... I went along with a bunch of Cobra buckles for a while. You gotta be cool, right? It's gotta be nylon made by an awesome company. But what did I find out later? Blue Force Gear, a company who loves to make things smaller and lighter, they came out with this belt. Of course, I got it in Multicam because, you know, cool guy factor. It is regular Multicam webbing, like is on a bunch of shit, and it's got two D rings on it about that. And it's got their logo on this like little bit of multicam Hypalon. I think it's called Hypalon. I don't, I don't know. It's that stuff that doesn't absorb water and shit like that. And it's got a little end the same way so that it doesn't fray. So it is this small minimalist belt that works great at holding up your pants. If that's all you need it to do is hold up a pair of pants, this is your cool guy minimalist tactical pants belt. That's all it's going to do because as you can see, it's real flimsy. I, uh, I tried carrying a, a gun on it, and uh, well, it you know, the gun didn't fall off or any, anything like that, it wasn't secure, like, it didn't stay in one spot in the right same orientation, it had a lot of flop and move to it. I tried just so I could tell you that I tried because I knew somebody was going to ask. It's not great for that, it would work in a pinch better than the cotton woven belt just because it's stronger, but uh. If you're looking at it just to hold up a pair of pants underneath of a bunch of other shit, war belts, gun belts, battle belts, whatever your belt system, weapons platform thing is called, this small belt might be a whole lot more comfortable and it will hold up your pants all day, every day. So there you go. That is the minimalist gun belt. No, no, no. Minimalist pants belt. Works great with the minimalist gun belt. Blue Force gear, 
Multicam, cool. What more could you ask for? Thanks for watching. Take it easy.